Anya Blakely? Then you know who I am. May I come in? Looking at you, I can see why my husband is so taken with you. I may as well admit he's probably in love with you. Do you love him? He said that to you. How? Oh. Yeah, sit down. Well, I came here because um, I want you to know that uh, I'm not going to give him up. No, this conversation is not over, Miss Blakely. Look, there are rules. Rules that you know just as well as I do when I'm not the one trying to steal somebody's husband. So, please. How old are you? 24, 25. 38. I've been with this man for more than one career crisis after another. I've stood with him at the funeral of both of his parents. I paid for him to publish his first book of poetry. I flew with him to Africa to attend the funeral of the only woman I believe he ever truly loved. And you, you're right over your head. So you think you're that woman? Let me ask you this, Tanya. How much of yourself are you willing to lose? How much are you willing to give up? Because I look at you and I just don't see it. See, that's not even what I'm talking about. I see a strong will, a pretty face, flawless skin, you don't have any scars on your knees. There's <laughs> no skin, hands. That was your character. What do you know about disappointment? I mean real disappointment, not a D on your term paper or this puppy love shit. Real disappointment. What more do you know about a man and that sliver of meat between their legs? You know anything about that torment that can burn inside of them? Do you think you can go in that hot, white heat and cool it down? Because you're going to have to do that a lot for Bernard, you know. I was very frightened coming here today. I look at you now and it all makes sense to me. You'll send him right back to me. I don't have to be afraid. <laughs> it's not a new woman he's looking for, Tanya. Ask him about Habiba.
I hope I can trade that in, but when it all comes to me, I realize that it's, it's going to be all right. I think it's a beautiful uh, I'm glad to share it with you. You were so engaging. My heart was racing when you were at the door. Yeah. In the middle of the piece, I actually had to tell myself to relax. My shoulders were tense. I felt everything. I'm still shaking from it. I mean, you really drew me in. It was incredible.